understanding, time's ticking, a phrase breakdown. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a common and intriguing phrase, time's ticking. This phrase is not just about clocks or minutes, but carries a deeper meaning in conversations. So, let's dive in and understand what this phrase truly means and how you can use it in your daily English conversations. In this section, we'll delve into the origins of the phrase, time's ticking, and its literal meaning. This phrase directly refers to the sound a clock makes, the ticking sound of the second hand as it moves. It's a reminder that time is continuously moving forward, second by second. But there's more to this phrase than just its literal interpretation. Now, let's explore the figurative use of time's ticking. In most contexts, this phrase is used to signify that there is limited time left to do something. It's a warning or a prompt to hurry up. For example, if you're working on a project with a deadline, someone might say, time's ticking, to remind you that the deadline is approaching. We'll look at different scenarios where this phrase can be effectively used. This section focuses on the cultural significance and variations of the phrase. Time's ticking is a phrase used globally, but its usage can vary slightly in different cultures. We'll explore these variations and understand how the phrase adapts to different English-speaking cultures. Here, we provide practical examples and show you how to use time's ticking in various sentences. We'll look at dialogue examples, both formal and informal, to give you a comprehensive understanding of how to incorporate this phrase into your everyday English. And that's a wrap on our exploration of time's ticking. Remember, this phrase is a powerful reminder of the relentless march of time and can add urgency or emphasis to your conversation. We hope this video helps you understand and use time's ticking confidently in your English conversations. See you in our next video. And remember, keep practicing your English because time's always ticking.